Hey YouTube, this video is a, uh, well I guess you could say it's going to be a room tour as well as a RetroArch showcase. If you guys don't know, RetroArch just released a new update allowing you to play your ROMs in native resolution on a CRT TV. When I found out about this, I was blown away. I decided to just run out and get a component to VGA converter and let me tell you guys, it works beautifully, better than I ever could have imagined. For the longest time, I was looking for a way to play Sega Saturn and PlayStation in its native resolution, and I knew of no solution. First, I tried PS3, as you can see down there. PS3 plays PS1, especially all PS3s play PS1 games, but what I discovered is that it upscales all PS1 games into 480i when the native resolution is 240p. So the only other way to get 240p on PlayStation 1 games is on RetroArch. Let me show you something. I went out on Craigslist and I got me a Sony Trinitron TV just for this purpose, just to try it out. And let me tell you, it works amazing. Let me showcase some um, Sega Saturn first off. This I was blown away by because the only way you could play Sega Saturn games, ISO images on the real hardware is to buy a $500 attachment. But the RetroArch emulator of Sega Saturn runs at full speed. Check it out, let me show you. Let me show you how this looks. Let's start with uh, Christmas Nights. Let's zoom out a bit. Check this out, look how I got it set up. This was unexpected too, how seamless it worked. But I am shocked. Check this out, look. Look at this. Like it's coming from a real Sega Saturn. That is insane. 240p, true resolution. I never seen nothing like it. Look at that. Smooth. I can't believe it. And then look at the monitor on the right. It shows game information and all that. This new RetroArch update is underrated. The, the CRT feature needs to, I mean, listen, you need to go out, get a CRT. I will never play emulators on an LCD ever again after getting my CRT. This is amazing. This is amazing. But yeah. Let me show you some more games. PlayStation. Look at this. You're gonna see the bio screen load up on the CRT like it does on a real console. Incredible. I'm gonna launch with my RetroArch version for the CRT TV. Look at this. Perfect. And then you can fast forward. Look at this, 240p, PlayStation. Exit out of that. And what really has me blown away is arcade. Arcade on CRT, check this out. Let's go with three Street Fighter, Third Strike. If I could find it, wherever is that? All right, let's just go with Street Fighter Alpha. This is incredible. But yeah, reason why I'm uploading this video is because I haven't seen nothing like this before. And I'm surprised that this, isn't, this feature is not more publicized. Look at this. Automatic. You load up any main game, right? And it loads up in this correct aspect ratio. No adjustments needed. Seamless. I can...
what else I could show you. But yeah, let me use this opportunity real quick just to show off my setup. I got the CRT, the LCD, PC, and down here I got the PS3 and the Wii. Well, the Wii I've been using to get 240p SNES and Sega Genesis, which has been working pretty good. But um, anything past Sega and SNES, the Wii is just not powerful enough to out to do it. So the PC was the perfect solution. That retro update came at the right time. And over on the right, I got an HDMI cable running to my 55 inch TV. Got the Wii sensor bar, Wave Bird controllers, Xbox One S. So yeah, all together, I think my setup's complete. If you think, if you guys think I need to add anything, let me know. I'm interested to hear. All right, guys, have a good one.